Manchester United made three major signings this summer. Romelu Lukaku from Everton, Nemanja Matic from Chelsea and Viktor Lindelof from Benfica. Three key positions strengthened. But for me, Ma Nemanja Matic has already shown that he is going to be Manchester United's player of the season so far. And arguably, he could show himself to be the best signing in the Premier League. And I want to explain exactly why I think that is the case. Manchester United's midfield right now is looking sturdy and confident and that is because Nemanja Matic brings so much balance to a midfield that has lacked balance for years and years. Jose Mourinho always has a defensive midfielder like Matic in his team. Back in Chelsea when Fabregas had a fantastic season, that's because Matic was alongside him and allowed him to be free and concentrate on just getting assists. That's exactly what he's doing now, this season, with Paul Pogba. That is why Pogba has been freed up and has started the season so magnificently well. And as I said, Mourinho's had these sorts of players throughout his whole career. Whether it's Claude Makélélé back in his first Chelsea team, whether it's Xabi Alonso at Real Madrid. They're the sorts of players that Mourinho loves to have in his team. And Man United haven't had one for some time. So the balance that Matic brings to the midfield, that's the first reason why he's been such an amazing signing so far. And a second reason that Matic has been so good, and it's one that's taken me a little bit by surprise, is just how good Nemanja Matic is with the ball at his feet. Now, I thought he was brought into Manchester United to be a midfield destroyer, break up the opposition's play, feed the ball to Pogba. Just do that in a sort of defensive midfield anchor. But Mourinho's using him in a midfield too, alongside Paul Pogba, instead of behind him. And what that means is that we're seeing Matic bring the ball out of defence a hell of a lot further and better than I thought he would. He isn't just passing to Popper, he's confident in striding forward with the ball at his feet and threading amazing passes to people. If he can do through balls over the top, he can do cross field passing, he can do short and precise passing as well. For me, Matic has got a lot more to his game than I thought he did. That's taken me by surprise, but in the absolute best way possible. And it's another major reason why I think Matic has been so instrumental so far this season for Manchester United. And another reason why Matic has been so good is the organisation that he has. Very tactically astute player. He knows exactly where the spaces are. He'll never leave a teammate two on one. He'll always be there to cover for them. But at the same time, he knows when to run forward. Matic, for me, is just offering so much more in midfield than just a defensive midfielder. I think using this 4-2-3-1 is allowing us to see more of Matic than we would if, say, we're playing a 4-3-3 and he's sitting at the bottom of a midfield trio. But Matic, for me, he can, be a, he can be a defensive destroyer. He can also be a creator. But his organisation in that midfield is bringing so much more balance to this Man United team, which has lacked it. You know, Pogba might be getting the headlines and Lukaku might be scoring goals aplenty. And Lindelof, may he turn into a fantastic centre-back as well. But just the assurance that Matic brings in defence. He protects his defence. But at the same time as that, he adds to Man United's attack. He really has shown himself as more of a box-to-box -box midfielder than just a pure out-and-out -out defensive midfielder. And one major reason why I'm so impressed with Matic so far is the reason he was brought to the club. His power and his strength and his ability to win the ball back off the opposition is unparalleled in Man United's midfield. He, let, he makes Fellaini look weak in terms of his ability to win shoulder. Just If he's alongside an opposition midfielder and they're battling for possession, Matic will win that duel and he'll win possession back high up the pitch for Man United. It's a big reason why Man United have been able to dominate games is because Matic has been able to win the ball back early and keep the defence pressed in their half so that when we do start a second wave of an attack we're not starting it from our own half. It makes it harder for a defence to stay organised and it makes Man United's attack a hell of a lot more deadly. And look how many goals Man United are scoring this season. Matic has been involved in plenty of those and I'm so impressed by it. And if you look at his leadership in the middle as well, Matic has won the Premier League title. He was outstanding when Mourinho brought him back to Chelsea from Benfica. Now he's showing that sort of leadership in midfield. He's telling players where to play. He's not leaving spaces unattended. He is the midfield marshal. And that is why I'm so in love with Matic already so far this season. Antonio Conte must be absolutely fuming that he was made to sell Nemanja Matic this year because not only did Chelsea weaken themselves, I think Bakayoko is a good player, but for me, Matic is a better player. They strengthened a title rival. And if we are going to mount a Premier League title push this season, if we do win the Premier League title, 
Matic is going to be a huge reason as to why that happened. For years, Man United's midfield has been weak. We've never replaced Roy Keane. I'm not saying that Matic has replaced Roy Keane. We've never replaced Paul Scholes. I'm not saying that Matic has replaced Paul Scholes. But in Matic and Pogba, Manchester United have got a midfield now that is capable of protecting the defence, but at the same time is capable of bringing the ball forward and creating. And Matic is a key, key component of that. We've now balanced ourselves in midfield and Matic is the reason why. That is why I think that Matic is going to be Man United's signing of the season and why I think he's going to be in Premier League Team of the Year and arguably could be the best signing that the Premier League has seen this season. Do you think I'm going over the top? Do you think Matic is that good as well? Let me know in the comments below. Drop a like on the video and subscribe to United People's TV if you're new. We'll see you soon. Take it easy.